Hi, I'm Laughing Woman, and I'm doing a reading so that we can see what the energies of this week are going to be and discover how to use them in ways that are beneficial. Well, we have a nice mix of colors this week. We have an air card, which is the mental energy. We have a water card, which is emotional. We have an earth card, which is our physical bodies and the way we sustain. And we have two spirit cards. What we don't have this week is a lot of passion and action. So this is a week that has a little bit more to do with, with being than it does with doing. But it's not a week where the doing doesn't happen at all. So this isn't complete vacation week here. The first card we've got speaks about working within your traditions this week. This is a great time to do things in the ways that your family has done them, whether that's cultural or just specific to your family, or in ways that you've become accustomed to doing them. This is also a week where you're going to have a tendency to be attracted to new things, to freshness. Let yourself enjoy that attraction, but this isn't a week to believe that that's something that's going to last because it may just be a passing interest. Wait for a couple of weeks before you decide whether this is something that you want to engage in for a long period of time. This is also a week to pay attention to the long term whether this is in your personal life or whether it's the way that you're interacting in the world, the way that you're consuming things, the way you're treating the environment. This week is about sustainability and making certain that what we're doing now is something that we can continue doing in the future. This is also a great week to explore new ideas. This may very well be on topics that you're familiar with. You're just taking it to another level or you're expanding out your own thinking. And this is a week to look carefully at some details. You're not doing a lot of intense work this week, so this would probably tend to be things that are more part of your daily life. When you're vacuuming the house, make sure you get the whole thing. When you're taking the kids to school, drop them off at school instead of two blocks away. When you're grocery shopping, get the entire list. When you're at work, Make sure you finish everything that needs to be done that day instead of leaving things left over for tomorrow. So in summary for this week, we're going to do things in ways that are traditional to our people. Not everything, but at least a few things. We're also going to let ourselves get attracted to something. It may be something new, it may be something old, but be in that flush of first attraction. We're also going to pay attention to the long term this week and make sure that the things that we're doing have a good impact as in the years to come. This is also a week when we're going to be exploring new perspectives or new ideas. And it's a week where we make sure to dot the I's and cross the T's, get everything done that's on the list. Have a great week and enjoy being practical at the same time that you're exploring new things.